Hello, hello, beautiful people. Welcome back to another video. The servers are currently offline for about three more minutes, and I thought I was about done with the Raxor. However, the combat achievements came out for a Raxor today, and I want to do all of this in today's video. I don't think it should be too hard. Most of these, some of these, I will already have completed. Some of them are quite interesting. So, yeah, we're just gonna start off by trying to get the six kills in ten minutes and try to do a perfect kill in that time as well and try to kill it without the boss moving and all these cool things. And after we're done with the easy ones, we're gonna try to complete some of the more complicated ones as well. But anyways, let's give it a shot. Let's see how it will go. I guess we automatically completed five tasks already because I had them done from ahead of time. So five out of 12 is already completed. We've already killed it 25 times. Oh, four times in 10 minutes is done already. 75 kills is done five times in 10 minutes. It's also done. And six times in 10 minutes, it's also done. So the game remembers that I've done this beforehand, which is very interesting. I don't know how that works. I wanted to go for that immediately. We could start off by getting a Raxor kill by killing six eggs and then moving on to harder and harder and harder tasks, I guess. The first thing I want to do is to kill a Raxor 10 times without leaving. I'm just going to go with my usual setup and we're going to see how it feels, basically. Uh, but yeah, let's give it a shot. Oh, maybe this won't count because I'm hitting myself with the mirror back. Let's take a look. Do I get the perfect kill or not? No, so that's not a perfect kill. Maybe I'll try to do one where a Rexer does not move. That could also be decent. Oh, so there it moves. Okay. Oh, I see. So perfect Rexer, I can't get hit by... Okay, so it's gonna be easier to just uh, kill all the eggs, maybe, and then do it with that kill. There's one where I need to make a Raxor kill itself in this entire enrage phase. That one's gonna be, I think, the hardest to complete. Do you guys know if the plugins are bad? Because for the 10 kill trip thingy, I don't think it should be that hard. But for some of the tasks, the plugins will make it easier. Especially the like step under one or whatever. Oh! Wait, that was perfect, a Raxor? What the hell? I didn't even try to get that, to be honest. I'm just doing the KC task, but I guess uh, we didn't take any damage from anything, so that is pretty nice. I mean, I was going for 10 kill trip, but I guess I bring Blood Fury for one trip. It's gonna make this a lot easier. Let's just focus on a no moving kill for this, because our Ancient Godsword let us down this trip, and we just bring Blood Fury for the next one. So make sure Raxor doesn't move. Kill this. And we just go for that CA and then we bank, we come back with Blood Fury and then we do the 10 kill trip after that. What I found surprising is that so many tasks were already pre-completed for me. Like I thought I would need to do it again, but I didn't. Okay, that should be fine. So I went back into that pool, but I don't think it moved. So there we go, swimming in Venom, my guy is dead and I'm gonna go get myself... I'm not gonna get myself a Blood Fury, maybe I'm able to complete 10 kill trips still as we go. So my food situation, I'm not very happy with. I'm dead. Okay, well, I'm an idiot. Right, okay. <laughs> Alright, well, anyways, moving on. What the fuck am I doing, man? Whatever. Thank you, Rick. Give me, like, it's fine, but I need this sapphire pretty badly. Oi, oi, oi. Um, how do I get back there? Let me... Oh my god, all right, well, so how does this work? I just need to go back uh, to GE, right? A like for the first death? Yo, thanks, man, I need it. All right, so let me grab the Venom. This is the first time I die at a Rexor, by the way, so I don't really know how to get my stuff back. I'm gonna assume there is the thingy right outside, hopefully, that I can just loot. Yeah, we're chilling, we're chilling. Okay, let's do, let's do 10 kills. I'll take the Blood Feud. It's gonna make this a lot easier. Uh, so guys, how would you go about killing all the eggs, by the way? Do I just take a single-handed crush weapon? Is that what I need? Wait, you can just scythe them? Wait, really? Okay, I'll do the next skill, I'll just scythe them. So there we go. Alright, so according to my chat, I should be able to just go around and scythe down the eggs for the kill where I need to basically kill all the eggs before killing the boss. So let's go ahead and give that a shot right now. Two. Okay, that worked. One. Okay, I can just do that, I guess. Wait, why did this one spawn? Wait, it's gonna explode. Wait, how does that work? Oh, you can keep killing eggs. Oh, there's more than six. I see. Oh my god, okay. Never mind, I'll do it again next kill. Okay, so one. So that's two. 
That's three. Oh yeah, I should probably play magic. Four, five. Okay, that should be six. And now I should be able to just kill the boss and it should work. Okay, so that should be killing spider after killing all the eggs or six eggs rather. So that helps a little bit. Not bad. Okay, now I just need to lock in and do it normally until I get the 10 kills in a row. Uh, did I do it? Arachnid Lover. Was that the 10 kills in a row? I think that would probably be it. Let's quickly double check. Yeah, 10 times without leaving. Okay, so now I could focus on perfect kill. Basically with the boss killing itself in the end as well then. So we've done already a ton. We just need to kill a Raxor without having Venom or Poison immunity. Okay, that's very easy, I think. Having a Raxite, kill three other Raxites. That I think I just need a slow kill, right? And then I just need the, to bait the Exploder onto the thingy. And I'm gonna leave the perfect Araxor 2 for the very last achievement because this one is a little bit harder, I'd say. So how about we start off by doing a Let It Seep In. And for that, I think the Noxious Halberd actually pretty useful because you can get rid of the poison by specking with this thing. And I'm pretty sure that will work. Uh, and just to not miss it, I'm just gonna bang the extended Antivenom because I know my muscle memory would just use that. So I'm not even gonna like pre-pot or anything because we're gonna just do one kill and bank for this. Uh, so how about we just go and do that quickly? So yeah, we are utilizing Blood Fury for these tasks because it just, I don't know, it just makes it nice, I feel like. And that should do the no venom protection kill. Absolutely no problem, didn't even utilize any food. So let's go ahead and loot, go to bank and set up for the next task. Okay, I'm not quite sure how to go about the Araxite betrayal, but I have to have Araxite kill other Araxites. Look, what I'm thinking of doing is basically having as many green or... Yeah, just green spiders out. Or will I just kill mirror? No, I, I just need to not kill the boss, right? So like here, I just need to not kill the boss and it should work. So I just need to tank a little bit, basically. I need to tank until this guy, this guy and this guy are out. Then I kite them all on top of each other. And uh, yeah, then we're chilling. Because basically what happens is if I attack this guy, I will kill it. And if I attack boss, I will also kill it. So we are now just in a very chill state where we are kind of running around. And we just want to wait until all of the three of these spiders spawn. And then this one, we will kite on top of this so it explodes and it kills all of them. Maybe like here and then like this. Come on, big explosion. Yeah, no. Nah, this guy didn't die. But I know, I know my plan for the next attempt. I'm not going to range pot and I'm going to hit mirror the backs both once with Ballista, so they're literally 1 HP. And like I'll kill all of them, so they will all be like 1 HP, but not dead, and then it's gonna be easier, I think. And you know what, just to keep it safe, I'm actually just gonna tank the explosion. I know it's gonna hurt, but wait, actually? Why did I, I'm a fucking idiot. How was that guy not low enough? Oh, again. Third time's the charm, let's go again. The guy is coming, there is no shot, right? I could in theory move here and then in theory move here and they should all explode right now. There we go, Jesus. All right, let's finish off the kill. That is not as hard as I made it, let me tell you. Nice, so now we only have one left. That was pretty good for the third attempt, I'd say. I could have done it on the first try though. It took us just about 30 minutes to do all of the tasks. So we're talking absolutely everything, including the 10 kill trip. Uh, but what is left right now is this Grandmaster task. Kill Araxor perfectly without hitting it during the enrage phase. So maybe my plan of how I want to do this is to have the, obviously the spiders explode on it or to just step under, right? Those are the two ways you can go about doing this. We might do a mix of both, I'm not really sure, but I need to make sure the kill before that is perfect as well. So this one could take us a couple of attempts, to be quite honest. Oh my god, I did the left click thingy. I think that's gonna fuck it. Oh, am I not even potted or what? I didn't even... Okay, that's def... So... What counts as a perfect kill? I genuinely don't know because I just fucked up everything, but I think the game still thinks I have a perfect kill going for me, which let me tell you, this is not a perfect kill situation. I definitely got hit by a lot of stuff. Let's see. If this is perfect, it really shouldn't be, but let's see what happens. 
Okay, it definitely wasn't. So where did it go wrong? Because I didn't get the pop-up. Hey, you've done this and this wrong. You know what I mean? So I could move two steps. Like so. And now I just need to one-hit it here. Oh my god. Swap left click. Reset. Okay, that's not gonna be perfect anymore, is it? Wow, wow, wow. Okay. It's fine. Maybe I bring like four prayer pots or whatever. But the problem with this is I won't be able to do the step under very well. Okay. I fucked it. Ah. Okay, I don't... How the fuck do I do this shit, by the way? No, I got another rack side head as well while doing the tasks. It is an absolute disaster. That's like number six, I think, as well. Okay, uh... I need some strategies to figure this out, to be honest. This one seems very annoying to complete. I just got hit by poison, and let's see. Perfect Araxor, you were hit by... Ar okay, so I failed the Perfect Araxor. I assume this just means I fail everything, right? Oh, you took reflected damage. I already failed it, by the way. I see. I see. Very unprofessional. Let's go out and then... Wait. Perfect Araxor, you're hit by Araxor. Okay, so... You cannot get hit by magic, by the way. So I have to kill it with Ballista, I guess. Don't mage me. Oh, FF. That was it, by the way. I had it. Okay, I, I can do it. I know I can do it. So there we go. Now we run to this corner. I fucked it because I hit it. Oh, my I did it. There's no way I didn't do it. There's no way I didn't do it. There we go. Ladies and gentlemen, just like that. Uh, with a little bit of milking, we've now done all the Araxer combat achievements. I'm very happy to have this done. Um, it didn't take me too long. I started the stream an hour and ten minutes ago. Um, I don't know if that's good. I don't know if that's bad. As you can see, I'm not really a combat task completer. But I'm very happy to have Araxer completed so fast. I mean, I did kill this boss over a thousand times. But really, it's been fun. The tasks are chill. They're not too hard. I'm very happy. So, Rexor tasks were actually very easy. I just did a whole recording explaining everything and I forgot to click start recording. But, the 12 tasks were all pretty easy. The last one was quite fun. My best tip, if you need to get this perfect Rexor kill, is to use a Ballista on long range and one hit everything as it comes out. And then, when it comes to the last phase, just permanently be under the boss. Utilize the shift click and menu entry swapper. To, to do this. Also, pardon, it's not the swimming in Venom, it's this one, the Perfect Araxor 2. Uh, this one uh, is the only, like, challenging one, I'd say. Everything else was simple, but I had a very good gear. So I guess if you're gear locked, uh, then it's a little bit unlucky. I have absolutely best in slot everywhere. If anything, I would recommend you to use Blood Fury. It makes things quite much easier, especially the kills where you need to be there longer. It's been pretty chill, and now the next goals for the account is to probably keep trying to get as many tasks done as possible. Uh, I do want to get to Grandmaster at some point in the future. And I guess this is like a motivation to start working on a bunch of these that I've never even touched.